Easy now. Good boy. Shh. You did good in Valentine. Told you it'd be a good score. Yep, you were right. Stay here. Wait here, boy. Well, I suppose I should be getting off. Sure, Morgan. All right, girl. Hey, Sean. Yeah, what's up, big man? <laughs> How much? What are you doing? Nothing. Nothing at all. I brought... Oh, hello, Arthur. And what's she doing? <clears throat> She's doing nothing, too. <laughs> what exactly are you planning? Just a little light robbery, Arthur. Nothing a serious fella like yourself needs to worry about. And you need to get Mary Beth killed as well as yourself? Away with yourself, Arthur Morgan. We'll be getting rich, not killed. <laughs> Besides, Arthur, I'm so bored, I'd rather be shot. If you insist, <laughs> I'm in. We don't want you in. We got this ourselves. I've seen you fight, little feller. You can kill any one of us, but I ain't letting you take her out robbing, not without an extra gun. But she'd be acting, not fighting. Sounds good. Come on, then. Let's try. Where are we heading? Back up north. It's coming down from Valentine. I know a great spot to set up an ambush. Just don't start acting like you're the lead on this, like you always do. Wouldn't dream of it. Time to go, boy. said, you'll be at the side of the road to flag them down. Give them some sob story. Yes, of course. Easy enough. We'll be hiding up above. Once they're unawares, I'll put in a few shots to let them know we mean business. Then move in fast to hold them up. Arthur, <laughs> I guess you can watch and give us marks out of ten. Right now, you're at a one. Jesus. Can't believe you have to tag along in this just to keep an eye on the girl. Remember the crap you gave me for turning up at that train job with Marston and Charles? I'm keeping an eye on you, not her. I know she's solid. off on the spot. So, you were saying? All right. Very funny. Hey, she's probably robbed more folk than both of us put together. I wouldn't go quite that far. Mary Beth can pick a pocket faster than you can blink, believe me. Let's cut up here. It'll be quicker. First time we laid eyes on her. She was being chased by three real angry looking fellers. Get a move on. So, I was saying, and we thought, oh, that poor young girl getting picked on like that. But she had a bag full of wallets and gold watches. Happy memories, I'm sure. 
So will you two write about that in your journals? Can we get back to the matter at hand here? My job that I've brought you both in on. We're ready, Sean. Yes, keep your hair on. All right. Just over this ridge, there's a spot that should give us a good view of the road. Let's leave the horses here so they're out of sight. We want a rifle with a scope. If you got one, we'll be back a bit from the road. Such a privilege to be instructed. This way. See the road down there, Mary Deck? She ain't blind. Come on, you two. This is gonna be fun. All right, Arthur. Me and you will take cover behind that log over there. Okay. You're the boss. Coming from the north any minute. You're up, Mary Beth. Well, all right then. You know what you're doing, right? Of course she knows what she's doing. As soon as the shooting starts, get low and get the hell out of there, okay? Of course. Here it comes. I put in a couple of shots to spook them, like, and then we we'll move in. Are you sure about that? Your eyes ain't what they used to be, old fella. If you say so. Let's leave the horses here so they're out of sight. We want a rifle with a scope. If you got one, we'll be back a bit from the road. Such a privilege to be instructed by the master himself. This way. See the road?
Hey, I need a cab. Not a problem. A driver's on the way. I'll be here. Open your damn eyes! Conservative asshole! Help!
Hey there, pussy. Are you watching? This is safer than crossing the street. Ooh, shit, bullshit. Well, less people have died doing this than crossing the street. How about that? <laughs> they called me insane when I said sell all your American equities. And now look at this shithole. Come on, lady boy. Let's go. Oh! Yeah! History coming at you live! Aim for that flatbed truck down there! Truck? What fucking truck? The one that's accelerating, duh! Yeah, I see it. Okay, whatever you say, man. How he get by? Huh? Spread out. Keep looking. Yours, boy. He's moving. Oh. Somehow managed to piece off both the communists and the gangsters. Word is, Pops Holland is seriously fucked thanks to you. Best way to make a crook squirm is to hurt his money. Huh. Yeah. I heard Frank Pagani told Pops to get his ass back to the freight yard. Pops isn't going anywhere until you're dealt with. I understand he's a hard motherfucker. He's a survivor. Thanks for looking out, Pablo. But I dealt with a lot worse than Pops. Go get that commie loving piece of shit, Holland. With you fucking up the airdrops, the people back... You've, uh, really got poor Frankie in a bit of hot water over at the bathhouse. Sorry, shitty pun. <laughs> because of you, Tony D'Arazio is having a hard time controlling the city's politicos, so he's ordered Frankie to keep an eye on the Imperial. It's a third strike, you're dead situation. How do you think you'll handle old Frankie? That's all up to him. Hey, I could tag along, my camera's in the car, and... You want to dig up more dirt for your rag, you do it on your own time. I ain't gonna drag your libelous ass all over town. I get it. I get it. Be seeing me know what some of this is. Wow. All this corruption can't be good for the city. I mean, it's great for my byline, but terrible for the taxpayers. Bernard has a singularly impressive ability to stay off the radar. Fucking cocksucker. Get out of here! What? Huh? God in heaven.
enemies over there. All units, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. Repeat, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return to patrols. Kavar called. He's at the City Hall construction site and wants to see me. He knows. I don't know how, but he knows I've been helping you people. He's gonna kill me, or I'm going to jail. Then he'll kill me. Oh, God. Go home to your wife, Lenny. Pack a bag, get out of town for a couple days. When you get back, this will all be over. You'll talk to Jimmy? Sure. Kavar's waiting for you. Well, he gone I'm gonna follow your advice. Get out of here. Reckon the construction site is really causing problems for Kavar. Age, but you never know. into huh what's fixing to shoot somebody
Smoke, who won't smoke? Bonjour. Hey. How you doing? 